Hi, so I'm like so tan right now. I put on self tanner again. So sorry for that. I haven't showered yet, so it's probably like really dark, but I'm back with another new video. Yeah. I feel like the past like week or two, it's just been vlogs because I've been traveling and just doing stuff. So I just thought it would be cool to like sit down. Okay, sit down and just do a, just do a video. So. I was thinking about what to do today, and last night I was watching some Dr. Phil, aka my dad, my father, videos. So I was like, let me do a Dr. Phil, like just like reacting to a Dr. Phil, Bill, right, Dr. Phil video. So I just started looking, there was nothing. So I remember the show I used to watch called My Strange Addiction. So I just searched it up, and there's a compilation, it's seven minutes and 53 seconds, and it's called My Weirdest, Strangest, Crazy Obsession, TLC UK. So it's not gonna be in America, so that's nice to know that it's gonna be the UK edition, so I don't have to worry about these, these strange people being my next door neighbors or anything. So we're just gonna watch this together, and just let's let's just see what happens. So let's just get right into it. So, so I've never seen this before, so this is gonna be a new experience for both of us. So let's just let's just press play. See what happens. So uh. my name is Nathaniel. I'm 27 years old and I'm in a serious relationship with Michael. Morning, baby. Nathaniel is in a committed relationship with a car that he's named Chase. He met Chase in a resale lot about five years ago. <laughs> I just feel a little uncomfortable watching this. This is very sexual. Like this freeze frame right here. What is going on, Nathaniel? It was love at first sight. Okay, that's literally so gross. Do you know how many bugs and goo get on the front of your car and you're just gonna like kiss it and lick it? Absolutely not. We'll have to be licking any bug goo. Gotta go. Demons, interior, and everything just together just seemed to fit, not just fit. Okay, you can make out with the steering wheel. That's disgusting because your hands are all over it. But like the the front bumper, like that go that 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 goes through a lot, folks. That just goes through a lot. I find this part of it the most sexy just because the subtle lines and curves. I'll give him a kiss here and just kind of caress him down the side. My neck. Can you imagine what the neighbors think? Like, what is it? Like what? Oh my gosh. Let's see what Kim has to say. Reaction was I was kind of shocked. Yeah. It was kind of weird because it's just hard to understand. <gasps> okay. So it seems we've switched from a car lover to this little girl in a cockroach, and I hate bugs of all kinds. Any bug, I hate it. Okay, this one's not gonna be fun for me. I can already tell. I can already. I can already tell. I can roaches. I only have. Five. Ew! Ew! It's on her hand. I feel a little lied to. This says Tulsa, Oklahoma. I was promised the UK edition. This is not too far from Georgia. Yeah, it is. It's like 12 hours. I don't know how freaking far Oklahoma is, but it's not, it's not far. <sighs> Shelby, her goal is to teach the world to not be afraid of cockroaches. Okay, here's the thing. I'm not afraid of them. They're just icky, you know? Like, I don't want that anywhere near me or myself. Or like in my room? No. Like I'm not like, oh my gosh, that thing is gonna kill me. Like no one's died from cockroach. Has anyone died from a cockroach? Has anyone died from a cock roach? I spelled cock so wrong. <laughs> Can a cockroach kill you? So I know of one death by cockroaches. A man choked to death on his own vomit after a cockroach eating contest when a piece of half-chewed cockroach got stuck in his throat. Okay, the answer's no. Wait, I'm sorry. Roaches are known to crawl into people's ears. I don't want to live on this planet anymore. But the answer's no, they can't kill you unless you eat them. Oh my gosh. I like roaches because when they crawl my arms, they tickle me, and when I hold them, they make me all happy. Uh. Ew, he looks like he wants to die. These parents are over it. They're like, I need Shelby gone right now. Out in the butt. She really likes them. Ew, 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 ew. Don't love the cockroaches, but I can deal with them. I do have freak out moments every once in a while. Oh my god, get those! Get them all! No, just escape, mommy. 
but overall, you know, I... <laughs> Meg is, she's pissed. Like, she's just pissed at this. She's over it. And he wants to die too. They just both are like, I need a new daughter. Come to accept Shelby's passions. I love air freshener. <laughs> These are just taking such different turns. Like, it's just like a minute of like a strange addiction and then it'll just like switch over to a different one. So apparently this woman likes drinking, eating air fresheners. I love it. Absolutely. What I love about drinking air freshener There's is the taste. <laughs> oh uh, my gosh! This woman just sprayed it in her styrofoam cup. I gotta go. I literally gotta go. <laughs> oh my god. There is a million air fresheners out there, mm -hmm. but the one that I like is fresh linen. I've tried other scents, but I don't like them. None of them taste like they say they smell. Cinnamon is not cinnamon. <laughs> Apple. There's no way. There's just no way. Uh, this is not real. Crisp is like dirt. Ew. I've got to have fresh linen. I literally crave it. In the last three ew, years. Ew, 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 ew. This close up of her mouth. I gotta go. Like, I gotta go. I've not had it. Tw 20 cans a week. We go through like one a month at this house. It's like spraying it. 20 a week. Ew, 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 we've switched again. So this one is another bug one, and I can't wait. I sting myself on my hip, my elbow. There's no my way. Finger, my ankle. There's no way. There's there's no way. There's literally no way. Forehead on the tip of my nose. The most I've ever given myself was between 15 and 20 in my left hip. I really love stinging myself with bees. <laughs> what? If I see a bee, I run and scream. And this woman takes them and just like <laughs> pops them right in. So. Margaret has been addicted to bee stings for the past 10 years. Her addiction started innocently as a way to relieve her arthritis. Does someone need to call PETA? Doesn't this kill them? <laughs> when it, the stinger comes out, have you not seen the bee movie where he gets hospitalized because he stings someone? <laughs> Doesn't this kill them? I had read how people have been using it to relieve certain pain symptoms. But the first time that I stung myself, it didn't hurt as bad as I thought it would. I don't care what kind of pain I'm in, I'm not gonna turn to some bees to sting me to help. It's just not happening. It's not happening. It just got easier every ew, time. Ew. <sighs> when I was pregnant, that one was just a no for me. This one we've switched. I don't know what it is. There's a lot of switching happening here, folks. It's a little hard to keep up. So, hope you're strapped in and paying attention. So, let's see what this one is. It's to take pieces of tissue and dip, dip them in bleach and take them like pills. But my nutritionist and doctor, they, they made me stop doing it. And, and I thought it was just because I was pregnant and it'll go away. But Gloria's bleach addiction didn't go away. And she's even taken it a step further. Every morning, Gloria now adds bleach her bath water. Oh my gosh. Okay, I hate the way bleach smells. It smells so bad. I cannot believe she used to like drink it and now she bathes in it and like pours it on her skin. I'm gonna take a shower and or a bath. I have to use bleach. I have to use it. My first one of water, then I have to take the bleach and I pour it in a tub. It's not a certain amount that I use. I just pour until I feel oh. like it's enough. She's going in with the bleach, Lord. Have you seen that video where she's like, two shots of vodka and like dump the whole- Two shots of vodka? That's what she's, she's like just a little bleach. Oh, we've switched from bleach lady. I don't know what this one is. I'm expecting my first child and I love sniffing and chewing dirty diapers. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's no way. Ew, there's literally no way. It has to have pee in it. It has to have. <laughs> oh, there, I, I have no words. In it. The heavier ones that have more pee smell better. There's no way. Yeah. 
There's no way. It's mm, soft. I love it. It just tastes amazing. I have one while I'm cooking in the kitchen. I have one in my drawers. I have one while I'm sleeping. Oh, what? I, I can't even watch this. What is Keisha doing? Keisha! I keep some in my trunk. I keep some in my pocketbook. Ew. No, for real. There's no this way. This is good. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Okay, continue. Can you imagine the producer sitting behind the camera, like asking her these questions? Like, all right, ma'am, so uh, what's your strange addiction? She's like, hold on. So we switched to a little boy. There's a lot of fans here. 200 fans. I have pedestal fans. This is a homeless pedestal fan. And the reason I bought it, these blades, tower fans. Tower fans are slim, so they can fit in tight spaces, yet they move a lot of air. Box fans, this is a beautiful treasury, perfect example of a box fan treated well. Fans? I mean, I've heard of having a lot of fans. <laughs> so. Enough of that. My boy would be so proud of me, so. It's beautiful. It's like a bird humming. <laughs> Passive fans. I Is he okay? <laughs> like, I think someone needs to like, enroll him in some therapy. I have literally no room to talk. I need a therapist ASAP, you know what I'm saying? At first you think, oh, that's just a footstool. Well, actually, as you can see when I lift it up, there's a fan, motor, and blade. Well, I always had a rule about not collecting ceiling fans. This is a 1980 Hunter original. My first thought was, when will it stop? So you don't. <laughs> Literally what? <laughs> He's like showing them off. Like this is like a model 2005. Like it's a freaking car. Like it's literally a fan. Also that boy's like nine. Apparently I've switched again. So this is a lot to keep up with. Would you go with like someone like me? Cause I'm old enough to be your mother definitely. Maybe yeah, old enough to be your grandmother. Well, depending. Well, take home, <laughs> oh well thank you. <laughs> You want to dance? Oh, that's right. Oh. Come this way. Thank you. Come this way. The date with Karen was incredible. She this woman is literally 75 years old and he is actually my age. He's probably older than me. He's like 25. This is... No! Why would you want to date Nana? No! This is 100% my type. Are they gonna kiss? I'm literally gonna cry. I'm gonna cry if they kiss. Oh! Have a wonderful time with Kyle. There's no way. No, this is so inappropriate. No, no. You were in your fifties when he was born. And I've had such an amazing time. I just don't want it to end. Is that the end of the video? Oh my gosh. Guys, that was, that was a lot to watch. Not even gonna lie. That, 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 that was, the video was what it promised. My weirdest, strangest, crazy obsessions. So let's just take a look at the comments. I just kind of want to see. This is what I said. The dad of the roach girl looks like he either wants to die or hasn't slept since the first crusade. That's literally what I said. Oh my gosh. Someone wrote a rap. How many bees she killed? A lot. How many cockroaches she got? A lot. How many bleach bottles she got? A lot. How many diapers she got? A lot. How many fans he got? A lot. <laughs> so this, that was, that's enough of, that's enough of YouTube for today. So, that was just a lot to watch. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm sorry you had to see some of that. I'm sorry I had to some see... I'm sorry that I had to see some of that. I just can't with the bug ones. And the eating things. Gotta go. So, this, just, if you ever want to feel better about yourself, watch one of these videos. You know what I'm saying? I feel good now. I'm like, wow, I'm actually pretty normal. Still probably need to um, consult a therapist, but... That's for a different day. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. It was a little different, but I just wanted to like sit down. I haven't done this in a while. So thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, subscribe, leave a comment, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Visco, Pinterest. They're all linked down below. DM me, say hey. I'll say hey back. Let me know anything you want. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye.